This is a fairly short video, it's just finding missiles basically in World of Tanks, the guided, and it's just a, a few little tips. You'd require a lot of patience. And basically it's, it's trying to hit things without them seeing the missile come in. And also I'll try and get the weak, weak spots on the armour. Sometimes you can get uh, one shot kills, things like that. It's not an exhaustive tutorial or anything like that, it's just, it's fairly obvious really, but it might help some people, but it's it's added another dimension to the game. And regardless of what anyone thinks about what war gaming are doing with the game, these, these things aren't going away, these missiles, because premium tanks have got them, so they won't ever be taken out of the game. Neither will the Cold War, War mode or the Armadillos, which unfortunately just plague era two in the Cold War. Major challenge. Which that's my opinion. There he stayed up too long, didn't he? I think he'd learn first time, but he's not he's not seeing the missiles coming. You need you need a lot of patience to do it, no. I get a pretty good guided shot on this one, on it. I switch targets. I, don't know if I think it's a Sheridan. I'm not. I'm not sure. I can't see. I'm looking at a little tiny. It left him with a little bit of life, like it always does, and that gets a bit annoying, especially when they're shooting back at you. That I'm. I doubt I'll do another. It's not really a tutorial, but watch this guy here. It, it, unbelievable. It. Almost lost his turret. <laughs> he just he went from full health to zero. Which is a bit bad. It, the one shots shouldn't really be in this game, I don't think. Uh, because it's it's just one of them games, you know, you can be in with a platoon mate or two. And you get one shot. It's happened in Everyone's had the experience with being in Plateau and the teammates got one shotted, or you've got one shotted, and you have to sit there watching your teammate play. But this, you've got to try and. I've got a choice of two here, I'm not even sure if it's going to hit someone, but it did. It's a, it's a matter of just getting the missile on target through some weak armour if you can, which is usually on top, on, especially on the T72s. Oh, my nemesis says, sees. The armadillo I hate these things. I should never been put in the game, but Sheridan takes care of it. You can take care of them with the BMP as well, the BMP 2 with the auto cannon and the missiles. The Sheridan missiles are faster, so you need to. Like, this is a nice leisurely missile speed, so you get lots of time to make adjustments but on the BMP but on the Sheridan it's much faster the missile speeds you can check them in the stats this guy just sits there even though he's been hit once uh, so I'm showing you the full little clip rather than just cutting it down no, give me time to reload and just drop another one on top I don't think it kills him though no it doesn't it leaves him alive but obviously he's got a lot of damage yeah, them armadillos, they, uh, you, you do stand some chance in the Sheridan against them and you can combat them, and the BMPs as well with the auto cannons. Which are re they're really fun, I must admit. I like the missiles as well, but you do, it's a different style of gameplay. Didn't do much damage. In fact, did very little. But sometimes that happens, but if you try and go through the front armour on the uh, T-72, it's, it's not going to. That took him out. Yeah, the missile speeds, uh, when this fires, you'll see, it's quite a lot faster. You can even see in the... You can even see in these clips that the missile speeds are quite a bit different. 
smoke effects are good, aren't they? I mean, they've done some good things with this game. That was having good done with them. It took a lot of health off him that one shot. The more bats are very vulnerable to one shots from the missiles. Especially if you can get them just in the side behind the turret. It seems to go one shot. This was a nice opportunistic shot. The guy's not spotted, but I could see him moving beforehand. Uh, that's why I was heading up that way. I'm, I'm, I'm not showing you the preceding bits on these clips, just basically the missiles firing. A lot of the time. And then he contradicts himself by showing the other lot of this. <laughs> so it's up in the air. And it's BMP, so it's... You see how leisurely that missile was going, but it really can help you to get the pull these shots off. I think this is where I spotted a Morbat and I just took him out with one shot. Totally by accident. This was the first time I realised you could you could do that. It just gets him just you see where the missile it's not where the red dot was. Where the missile it was just behind his turret on the side plate and, and it just took him completely with one shot. Where we've got two targets and I lost this one really high. But look how long I'm having to let it get some altitude and then bring it down. And there was no outline around the missile for some reason, which was a bit of a bug in the game I had yesterday. Now this is just a bit of fun with the auto cannon on the BMP. But you can set people by surprise. It doesn't always work out like this, quite often you get blown up by someone else. So these, there's two guys making a run for it end of a game on here, just trying to elongate the game. Raise is best known of themselves. One of them's not spotted. Now he gets snagged up on the guy that I've just killed. It is fun, I will admit. But that's about it anyway. I hope you enjoyed watching that. <laughs>